red and black. Hey, fellas. Please stop associating me with your butt cheeks. Logan, play his theme song. It's hilarious. Uh, hey, where are you going? Just ignore him. Because I'm Batman. Okay, now that's just too far. There's a... So, did you see the new trailer? Yes, who didn't? It's like super viral. I know, right? Pretty popular, huh? It is! There's so much mystery to it. Uh-huh. And dark. Yep. Like, what's gonna happen? I know, they're not giving very much away. And when they showed Ray on the side of the cliff just swinging that lightsaber... Oh, you're talking about... I was like, get it, girl. Star Wars. You learned those Force powers. Again. And the tragic Star Wars theme with the title card when Luke says, It's time for the Jedi to end. Oh, so powerful. <sighs> what? I'm not talking about the Star Wars trailer. I'm talking about our trailer. Again. Oh. You mean the Justice League trailer? What other trailer do you think I'm talking about when I say our trailer? Well, I wasn't in that trailer, so I wasn't sure you meant we as in you and I, or we like the royal we, man. Hey, Lebowski. I'm talking about the Justice League trailer. What did you think? I thought it was fine. I mean, Aquaman making car surfing look cool is probably not the greatest thing to teach kids, but I'm, I'm really way more concerned about what's going to happen to Ray. Ray, what about the League, dude? What's going to happen to them? Probably nothing. This is your first team up. Do you think Rey's the last Jedi, or is Luke? <sighs> and does he mean like the way of the Jedi must end, or that there can't be any more Jedi, ever? Or is it like, if you wanted, you could study the Force and carry a lightsaber, you just can't call yourself a Jedi? You sound like such a dork right now. I'm a dork? Hey, uh, raise your hand if you're wearing your normal clothes, or if you were wearing a costume resembling a winged mammal. Oh, what do you know? I'm dressed like a bat because I'm Batman. So these are my normal clothes. In your face. You're still a dork. I'm sorry, I have so many questions. Do you think Ray will turn to the dark side? No. Do you think we'll fight dark side? No, I think you're gonna fight me and my mullet. Do you think Ben Solo's gonna turn good? You mean Kylo Ren? No, Ben Solo. I really doubt that's the path they're gonna take on this one. Do you think Ray is related to Ben Kenobi? Possibly. Do you think we're gonna knock down a bunch of buildings again? Of course. Do you think there'll be a Ghost Obi-Wan scene? I don't care. A Ghost Yoda scene? I don't care. Ghost Anakin? I really doubt they'd be that brave. Do you think that engagement ring you gave Lois is the reason she's the key? Yes, it better be. Otherwise, that whole thing is just silly. I know. Saying you guys are in love is laughable. Dude, we flooded a bathtub. And? I really hope Ray is a Kenobi. Ray Kenobi sounds so cool. I am Ray Kenobi, and I'm a Jedi like my grandfather before me. Why can't Ray have her own last name? Why does she have to be linked to the original cast? I bet Ray's supposed to be different. I bet she's her own thing. <gasps> like David Pumpkins. Exactly. Ray Pumpkins. She's her own thing. And the droids are part, part of, of it. it. Huh. David Pumpkins is Ray's father. I think, really, you should be asking who is her mother. Do you think her mother's name is Martha? Stop it. Also, I thought you didn't care. I don't. I think it's going to be Empire Strikes Back all over again, except with a new cast. Well, I hope you're wrong. Sort of. I do want her to get her hand cut off, which is a weird thing to wish on someone. But I hope it's not a carbon copy of Empire. Well, get ready to be disappointed. You get ready to be stupid. What? Because I probably won't be disappointed, even if it is just like Empire. How does, how does that make me stupid? It just does. Can we just talk about the Justice League trailer now? Nope, because I'm not in that trailer, so that trailer sucks. Well, by that definition, that would mean the last Jedi trailer sucks. Oh no, <laughs> dang it. That's not what I meant. Too late, you said it. You think Star Wars sucks? I do not! Yes you do, I figured it out, because I'm bad. Dang it! I don't want to play anymore. What? Why? This is fun! You can't just swoop in here and save the day. This is my story. Your story? Yes, my story. Check the name on the box. B-A-T-M-A me. I sang a song about it and everything. Oh, I heard the song. Your catchphrase was very obvious. I had this whole epic moment happening. The town was literally divided. And we were going to have to come together to save ourselves. It was extremely touching and very relevant to the times. And you ruined it. You also came into my house, smashed all my crystals with my father's memories, taught a child to steal from me, and then released literally every criminal out of prison. <laughs> yeah. I forgot I smashed your family's memories. That was hilarious. Oh, you want hilarious? How about I sing your theme song? That's really not necessary. Because I'm Batman. Who has no powers? What? Batman. Who's afraid of snake clowns? That's Batman. perfectly normal. 
who's addicted to caffeine. I have a lot of late evenings. Who needs a justice league? Not bad, man. You wash your face. Give me those. What's wrong with you? You're no fun. Hey, Pewter. Change password to kal sucks. Batman, we don't use the word sucks. That's not nice. Oh, come on, Alfred. Stupid parental setting. Blue, yes, a blue's favorite brew blowing up. And so we blew up my father because he was evil and insane. And also a planet. And I helped! And also survived! Hey, what's up? I'm Batman. You wanna know my secret identity? Sleep. <laughs> Well, that's a nice trick. So you killed your own father? That's crazy! No, he was crazy! And besides, he may have been my father, but he wasn't my daddy. Eh, uh, sounds less manly when you say it. Yeah, I realize that now. Sorry. Dad? No, we ain't there yet, boy. Well, hooray for everyone and their dads. You know, some of us never had a father. Like the talking puppy, I too never knew my father. I knew my father extremely well. He was a love machine and would tell us stories about it regularly. Oh my gosh, we all know your dad was a hornball. We get it. Everybody has some kind of dad drama. My father's probably going to kill everyone on this planet. Not if I have anything to say about it. Jinx. Anyways, I had two dads as well, and if I could, I would have tried to save them. You let Paul Kent die in a tornado. Dude! I thought you were asleep. I was. But I was also still listening. Because I'm Batman. I am Groot. I'm Batman. I am Groot. I'm Batman. Well, I'm Mary Poppins, y'all. Oh no. I am Groot. I'm Batman. I'm Mary Poppins, y'all. 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 Did someone call my name? Holy crap! Mary Poppins is real? What? Mary Poppins is a woman? Hi, priestess. They met in the cafe again. Typical. So predictable. When they see what I've created here, their precious cafe will be ruined. I think I shall call him... Martha. And that's the end. So, don't you want to ask questions and pick apart my story? Nah, I'm just really happy we get to hang out. Me too. Well, this is surprising. Thank you. No problem. So you took out the plane? Yeah, I took out the plane because things were getting way too Captain America. What do you mean you're like Captain America? You just carry a shield with a star in it, fought in a world war, and had a boyfriend named Steve that was going to sacrifice himself in a plane. Oh, I see it now. I don't care if you are like Captain America. I think you're inspiring. Unlike some other superheroes. I know, right? The boys make everything so dark and depressing. <laughs> hey, ladies. You want to know my secret identity? Ew, gross. No, thank you. You're like friends with my dad. Hey, Diana. You ready to get started or what? It's time to assemble. I mean, the. it's time to unite the League. What's he doing here? Oh, I forgot. I got to go help the boys with this thing. Gotta fight Superman! Demon wasp people! It's really important to them. I bet Green Lantern shows up too. It's gonna be sick. Sounds cool, actually. Can we come? Oh, I'm sorry. The, see, the, the Justice League is really just us. You know? The Just Us League. <laughs> you get it? Fine, whatever. You're lost. I said the Just Us League. Oh, we get it. And I'm the, and I'm the boss. Do you know why? Because I'm It's bad. not always about you, Bruce! Can you, can you believe it? It's so awesome. Isn't it awesome? Tony, this kid hasn't even graduated. Is he, uh, dropping out of school to fight crime? I mean, he can't just live with the Avengers. Can he? Sure he can. I gave him a suit and said he's part of the team, so he's part of the team. Yeah, I am. You gave a teenager a weaponized super suit. Am I the only one that thinks this is weird? You didn't even, like, talk to Aunt May about it. Peter is a minor. This feels like kidnapping. I'm, I'm gonna have to take you in, Tony. Iron Man v Superman. Now that's a billion dollar idea. 
but I wouldn't want to publicly destroy you, so I politely decline. <laughs> you, you, you can't. You, you couldn't destroy me. Do you think I don't have kryptonite tank missiles up my sleeve? Do you? Friday, put kryptonite missiles on my to-do list, please. Yes, sir. Guys, listen. He deserves this. He's coming home. This is his home. And I'm a great father figure for him. You are luring a miner to the Avengers and making a replacement Iron Man. Yeah, he's got the iron suit and everything. No one is replacing anyone. Oh, really? Then how come you put a parachute in the new kid's suit, but not my suit that's actually meant to fly, huh? What's up with that? That was a design flaw. It didn't occur to me until Spider-Man. Do you have a parachute in your suit? Uh... You're replacing me, aren't you? Again! Oh, Mr. Stark, I, I don't want to replace anyone, you know? That would just suck. Yeah, it does suck. Being replaced sucks a whole lot. <laughs> now you know how I feel. <laughs> Guys, I'm, I'm really sorry. I, I guess I just feel so lucky, you know? There's been all these reboots and do-overs, but I made it. I'm finally home now. And now I know they'll never replace me. Yeah, don't be too sure about that. What are you doing here? You're not a superhero. I like to sketch people in crisis. <laughs> it's you. What the? Oops, not that one. This one. <laughs> You're so mean. <laughs> so yeah, he was obnoxious, but the kid had spirit. Plus, he apparently had a lot of money and could make me lots of really cool gadgets. Uh, you know what that's like, right? Yeah, because I'm Batman. That sounds a lot like child labor. He wanted to be involved. Plus, he's a good guy now. What's up, fellas? Looking good, kid. I mean, can you imagine if I turned him away? Let's just say this cafe scenario might have been something completely different. Who would ever enjoy that? I I think you'd be surprised. So then what happened? <laughs> well, it's been years, but some people tried to sue me for saving their life. The government wrote some laws telling us to be normal, but <laughs> the supers just laughed like, try and make us. <laughs> you guys are lucky you didn't have a civil war or something over that. <laughs> hey, honey, ready to go? Uh, sure. Uh, do you guys know the missus? Uh, nope. You look familiar. Have we met? Yeah, she does seem familiar. You sure you've never seen her before? Nope! This this is the first time! My champion! So the doctor fixed my hammer, our sister is falling in an eternal abyss, I'm gonna be the king of Asgard, and everyone is happy and good! <laughs> Isn't that right, brother? Yes, everyone is happy and good. Hmm. This is weird. Yeah, I'm not comfortable with this. What's wrong, Batman? Don't you trust that I'm a good guy now? Nobody in their right mind should trust you. Why? Because I'm bad. Oh, sorry. Force of habit. I mean, because you're Loki. My dear Batman, do you think I'm going to get people's hopes up and then ultimately let them down when the time comes? Yes. What do I look like? The Justice League? <laughs> Zing. So mean. Permission to uh, punch your brother in the face? Uh, denied. I'm joking. It's a friendly joke. You like jokers, right, Batman? Yeah. This is all wrong. He's not supposed to be here. Yeah, can I just turn back time and make things back to normal? What do you mean? Everything is back to normal. My brother and I are together again. I have my hammer. I have my hair. I don't have a girlfriend currently, but that's not even a problem for me. Everything is back to normal. Except, uh, well... Except what? Except father? Except Hulk is still missing. Oh. I forgot. Banner. I'm not sad. I wonder where he is. Don't worry, Hulk Fine! Ah, yes you are. Great job, everyone! We saved the world! Yeah. <laughs> Alright! Booyah! Flash killed a guy. Yeah, I killed Steppenwolf with a trident. Yeah, I've been meaning to talk to you about that. You should probably stop murdering all the bad guys. Oh, is that not, like, our thing anymore? I thought that was a thing we do. Well, we finally did it. We finally showed the world that- I'm sorry, your facial hair is just too distracting. If we could just- There we go. That's better. As I was saying, we finally showed the world that real heroes do exist. And now the world can be inspired again because we are great role models. Is that what we did? Not even close. 
Yeah, I think we sort of rushed a team hero story with a seriously divided Superman origin arc. Nope! The name of Superman is fine, because I am a beacon of hope and inspiration. When did you say inspiring things exactly? Let's not go there. Maybe the 80s? Dude, I talked to that kid about hope being like his car keys. Yeah, and you also talked about death being itchy and like... Really weird. Well, at least I didn't let my best friend's mom lose her house while I was too busy building a Quinjet. Hey, I bought your mom's bank right at the end. Oh, because that was easier? Well, this is off to a great start. We have to be better, guys. There are much larger villains out there than Steppenwolf. Like who? Like Darkseid? No, like me. What the? Wh who is that? I am your demise. I am your destruction. <laughs> the Slayer of Franchise. I. Am. Murder. <gasps> Where did you say that next? Everyone okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Ah, why the cafe? It was loved by millions. It was, and you allowed it to be ruined. You thought your mere presence was all it took. It appears this Martha has come from another universe. Which universe? Not sure. Looks like a unicorn. <laughs> I will destroy it all! If you refuse to world build, then you don't deserve a world at all! You can't win, Martha. It's six versus one. Make that seven. Yay. Here. I'm a little late to the party, but better late than never. Steve? Who's Steve? He sounds amazing. I I'm sorry, you look just like my... Can I call you Steve? As you wish. Excuse me, you're too late! You're all too late! You'll never be the heroes everyone loves again! The damage is done, and you lost! LOST! <laughs> All because of the mighty Martha. Oh my gosh, I'm so over this Martha thing. Justice League huddle. Flash, you take Diana's lasso and bind Martha's ankles. Cyborg, you grab his arms. Aquaman, go tell all the tuna to gather all the jellyfish they can find. Are you serious? <laughs> no. You help Cyborg. Then, Green Lantern and Diana will take turns hitting- I'm sorry, wait. Why are you the leader again? What? I said, why are you the leader? <laughs> Because I'm Batman! I know, I just, I don't care. I just wanted you to do your thing. We don't have time for this! We are doing Bruce's plan, okay? Ready? Break! Yeah. You just got served. Some justice. Oh my gosh! Have we learned nothing? And get these two. A cafe. Oh, thank God. Oh my gosh, you can afford a cafe, you- Oh, this cafe is nice. It's like nothing ever happened. Yeah, apparently vibranium just fixes everything. Yes, it does. It is really quite convenient and seemingly capable of fixing anything. Would you like some? No thanks, Catman. I'm good. Because I'm Batman. Besides, something tells me you're gonna need that vibranium more than us. Why is that? Hear me and rejoice. Mercy is upon you. Just a feeling. And so I defeated Thanos, because I am truly awesome. I have this amazing new axe, the rabbit gave me a new eyeball from his buttocks, and I'm the rightful king of Asgard. Which is now Earth, by the way. I forgot to mention that. So I suppose that makes me your new ruler. So, you're welcome. What did he say? Is he talking to the whole table? Because I wasn't listening. Can you speak up? I said I'm your new ruler. Yeah, Earth doesn't work like that, I'm afraid. Well, me and my new Infinity Gauntlet beg to differ. I will follow the majestic pirate angel man anywhere. Well, I won't. Hey, jerk face. My girlfriend died for your precious gauntlet. Oh, you mean this girlfriend? Whoa. Where am I? Awesome! Ah! There is Gamora! Okay, I take it back. That Thor guy is pretty great. <laughs> well, you guys... We finally made it. What an achievement, right? <laughs> Look at us. Everyone's here. The Guardians, Spider-Man. Sure, he even made a new vision. Thank you, Vibranium. Yeah, everyone's here except Hawkeye and the Netflix Avengers. And Ant-Man. My bad, guys! Siri didn't know how to get to Wakanda! Okay, except those guys. 
We're all here, though, and we won the day. What are you talking about? We always win. This is like every summer for us. Can you imagine if we actually lost? Oh, that'd be good. <laughs> <awesome. laughs> oh, yeah, that's yeah, that's really good. People be emotionally scarred for life. I literally just became the king of Wakanda. Well, thanks to us, and mostly me, we didn't lose, so. A toast. Here's to the greatest team in the whole universe. Yeah! yeah. To Vibranium. Vibranium! Yeah. Yeah. And to a couple of tagalongs, who are pretty awesome as well. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. yeah. Are, are you talking about us? I'm not a tagalong, I was here first. Yeah, if anything, you guys are on my third wheel. Do you know why? Because, because you're Batman! <laughs> That's right. Because I'm Batman. I am Groot. I'm Batman! Wow, I really thought that was gonna come back to me. He's a teenager. He didn't care about anything right now. Well, I guess I win then. Because I'm Batman. I'm Steve Rogers. Dang it. Please stop. Hey, remember when we had that civil war? And wanted to kill each other for nothing? <laughs> <laughs> I got paralyzed. <laughs> we were all arrested. Remember when Rhodey had a different face? Remember when Bruce had a different face? I remember when Black Widow made me believe we had a future together? <laughs> she did. <laughs> <laughs> remember when I saved the world from Dormammu without any of you? Don't make up stories, Strange. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not making it up. Remember when I killed Tony's parents? <laughs> I'm still not 100% okay with that, you one-armed Jesus. <laughs> Two arms, you... Wait, what? <laughs> I told you I'd get that arm. <laughs> <laughs> Silly rabbit. Tricks off a wizard. <laughs> I love that theory. You guys seriously don't understand how many times somebody <laughs> died. Just so <laughs> Happy endings are so cheesy sometimes. Hey, man. My name's Kork, and this is my very good friend here, Meek. We're gonna go to that jukebox over there and play some music. Wanna come? Sure, why not? And then I was all, tank missile. Remember when Star-Lord used to be immortal? Remember when I was frozen? Has anyone else been to the ancestral pool? Anybody wanna buy a robot arm? What about the spider? Does he need a robot arm? Oh, I like this too. Has a nice beat. <gasps> what did you just do? So did you see that Teen Titans thing? Yes, I did. So what'd you think? I think Robin better watch his rated R mouth before he gets punched in it. No, not that Titans thing. Ugh, no. I'm talking about the cartoon movie. Oh, that. That movie about superheroes wanting to be in the movies instead of actually being heroes? Yeah, I saw it. Wasn't it great? I don't know. What? No way. I thought it was super fun. I laughed so many times. It just felt like a bunch of poop and fart jokes to me. It wasn't serious at all. Like, where's the darkness? Where's the intense villain? I think we've had plenty of dark and intense. I mean, what's wrong with bright and colorful? Nothing, but it seems like everything's going the bright and comical route. Shazam. Aquaman. You think Aquaman looks like a comedy? Looking comical and being a comedy are two totally different things. What's wrong with Aquaman? Nothing. I'm sure fighting fish m and is going to be the greatest story ever told. <gasps> Shame on you. You are in a mood today. I'm just tired of the inconsistency. One day, we're dark. The next, we're epic. Then, Aquaman's trying to be the Lord of the Water Rings. Suddenly, Robin's dropping F-bombs, and Shazam is flossing. I'm just like, what are we doing? You're keeping it fun, and you should be happy. The Teen Titans made you look like the King Superhero. Well, that's because I am the King Superhero. Do you know why? I know. I know what you're gonna do right now. I, yes, I do know why. Because, because you bad. have Alfred. Yes, I know. I don't need your catchphrase every other sentence. Well, at least it's not Robin's catchphrase. Stop it. You didn't like that? What kind of person that fights crime yells, Crack an egg on it. Cha -cha! I thought that was hysterical. I'll tell you who said something like that. A crazy person, that's who. You are being way too judgmental. And you're being way too easy on that story. Oh, I'm sorry, I really enjoyed the comedic cartoon movie. I think maybe you forgot what movie you bought tickets for. It was supposed to be light and silly. Yeah, it was really light and silly when they ran over that Michael Bolton cat and left him to die on the road. I'm... I'm sure he's fine. That's why I'm feeling a beat, a beat. Can't feel my legs. They also left those unknown guys to die in that dark dimension. That was a joke. And... They used time travel to totally save my parents, but then used it again to make sure they died for real the second time. Oh. I see now why you didn't like that story. How do you have time travel and not use it for good and call yourself a hero? Let me try to explain this to you. They are teenagers. They're reckless. 
I think we just agree to disagree on this one. Yeah, whatever. Up, oh, fellas! Did you see our movie yet? Heck yes, I did. Nice one, guys. I loved every second of it. Titans, victory dance! <laughs> oh, yeah! Not Superman, though. He thought it sucked. What? I thought Ant-Man and Wasp would have been here by now. What the heck was that? Uh, Nick Fury just turned to dust in front of our window. We gotta do something. Um, Bruce? This is different. What the? Cal! Speak to me! What's going on? Oh no. Oh no. Not today! Because I'm Batman! <sighs> I will avenge you, Superman. I mean, <clears throat> I will unite the League, you, Superman. Oh, never mind. His dust is rising. He'll be back. So we took off everyone's brainwashing masks, and that was pretty much the end of it. Yeah, that's right. We took care of it, because we're awesome. That is great, kids. So then what happened? Well, Evelyn went to prison for attempted murder, and the supers are totally <laughs> legal again. <laughs> Which is good, because I think Mom and Dad really needed it. Where are your parents, exactly? Oh, they're having date night. Yeah, I'm sure they're doing something super romantic. Blech. You'd think if they like helping people so much, they'd try to get work in the police force or the fire department or something, but whatever. I mean, Use your skills pushing paper till you go crazy, I guess. Or you can just do it in secret like me. Cops get mad at me all the time for doing their job for them. Do you know why? Nostalgia! <laughs> Bruce, I think I've been playing too much Pokemon Go. Interesting. Because right now it looks like there is a giant Pikachu sitting next to you wearing a Sherlock Holmes hat. Well, I do think you are playing way too much Pokemon. I'm happy to report. You are not seeing things. Say what now? There is, in fact, a Pikachu sitting next to me in a Sherlock Holmes hat. What? That thing is real? Yeah. A real life Pikachu? Yes, it is. You're telling me I'm looking at a real Pikachu? That's what I said. He's really excited. We call it fangirling. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. This is so cool. Hello, Pikachu. I'm so exciting to, I mean, it is so exciting to meet you. Pika, Pika. I know, right? Where did he come from? From Pokemon, duh. I know that. I mean, why do you have him? Is he yours? Did you catch him? No, he's not mine. He's just a detective for some reason. So I guess he came here because he wants advice from the greatest detective of all time. Pikachu? No, not from Columbo. From me. You snarky fuzzball. Pika. Watch it. Choo. Hold on, wait a second. You can understand him? Well, of course I can. Because I'm Batman. Apparently the only ones who can are me and the kid from Jurassic World. Pika Pika! What is he saying? Ah, just detective stuff. He also sounds exactly like Deadpool, which is really weird. What's so weird about sounding like Deadpool? Because Deadpool is nothing like Pikachu. That's why. Hey, Dork Knight. Not all Pikachus are the same. Besides... Pika Pika! Pikachu! Well, I guess you guys sort of do have that in common. So anyways, I'm just teaching him everything he needs to know about being an amazing detective. Right, amazing detective. Okay. Feed me, pointy-eared man. Okay, first thing you need is a super awesome butler. Do you have a super awesome butler? I have a super awesome butt. It shoots out all kinds of electricity. Do you have endless amounts of money? I'm worth about 15 billion. Is that enough? It's a start. Do you have access to a utility belt? Pika! Well, we've apparently got a long way to go. A Detective Pikachu. I just can't believe this is how I'm meeting a real Pokemon for the first time. What do you mean? I don't know, I just thought it would have been with Ash and Misty or Team Rocket. Certainly not as a detective. I think the Pokemon origin story has been pretty much established. Plus, I think a real-life version of that story would be met with extreme prejudice if it wasn't perfect. What, you think people would reject seeing live-action versions of the original Pokemon cast? I can't tell if you're being sarcastic. I'm serious. They're making everything into a movie now. Why not this? I saw this live-action trailer of The Lion King earlier, and I thought it looked amazing. Pikachu! He's right. That's not live action, dude. And second, I would argue it only looks amazing because you enjoyed the original so much. So? So powerful music is always powerful. I don't understand why that's bad. It means the music is doing the heavy lifting. 
You of all people should know what that's like. What, heavy lifting? No powerful music in a trailer hyping up an otherwise average movie. Pika Pika! <laughs> oh, haha, ha, very funny. You don't know. I know making films on established characters is very delicate, so I think leaving the original alone and focusing on the obscure video game title is actually pretty wise. Pika P! Exactly. This way Pikachu gets to have a unique story while still having that precious nostalgia bait. And it's also a way to capitalize on Ryan Reynolds. That too. That's kind of sad. Why does nostalgia bait have to be a thing? Because if you can make people remember something they loved when they were younger, they will get excited and want to watch it. Which means the studios will make a lot more money. The Pokemon gets it. You might be a great detective after all. Pika Pika! That seems like such a gimmick. Who falls for that? Everyone. Well, not me. I'm not going to fall for that. I only want to enjoy original stuff from now on. Bye, Fred Savage! Watch my movie, you guys! Deadpool Princess Bride. Princess Bride. Ha, hey, I know what that is. That's that guy from that movie I liked back in the day. That's awesome! I'm definitely going to go see that. You see what I mean? Oh, yeah. Pika-pee!